Hey guys, Mel the Train Tutor here with a bit of a ramble thingy thingy thing. Ramble. <laughs> but with a specific topic. Right. Uh, first off, I'm recording it on my webcam with bloody awful lighting. I mean, look at it. Look at the light. The contrast. Yeah, but I mean, at the end of the day, I'm just talking. I'm not showing you techniques yet. And so you don't really need to see my beautiful face in high def, do you? <laughs> Okay, so what's this ramble topic about? Well, there's two things we're going to be talking about, yeah? One is video topics, yeah, that I do and how I choose them. And two is my big burner project. Mm hmm Did it. We should call it a little sound I'm like, did it. Right, oh God, I'm in a giggly mood. I mean, I've had a good day, you know what I mean? I've you know, cut my hair, had a shave, I'm feeling fresh, I'm feeling a bit... Waiting for the wife coming, yeah? Oh, that's enough of that. Right. Bosie, what do you like? You know how I am with my rambles. I'm <laughs> not exactly professional, am I? Right. Video topic. Yes, let's get stuck in. Right. If you've been following my channel for a long period of time, you'll see that my videos sometimes makes sense or in a logical order sometimes the most random stuff comes in sometimes i do really basic obvious stuff yeah that you think well you know duh okay and there's there's three main ways that i choose oh my battery's low put that in charge because i need that later there's three main ways how I choose my video topics, okay? Now, one is planned. And what I mean by planned is I have a big list right up there on my whiteboard, on a little clipboard, yeah, of all the different video topics that I want to do, that I've thought of doing, okay? And it's a logical plan. It builds on each other. Very much like if you look at any of my playlists, you'll see that each step builds and builds and builds up a wealth of knowledge, yeah? And it's structured. I know, you know, where they are, what they do, you know, the purpose of them. I know what the end goal of that particular video is or a collection of videos that will make up a new playlist, etc. And they will build a wealth of knowledge. Yeah. And that's all good. That's nice and logical. And, I, you know, I, when I started the channel, that's exactly how I did it. Yeah. And then it sort of evolved. Yeah. And then we got sort of opportunity videos when I was sort of doing different projects I might do a little commission for someone and it gave me an opportunity to show you okay those videos those techniques and they were completely out of place in the structure but I had an opportunity to share it so I share it so it, it sometimes come along as a bit random or sometimes you get a glutton of videos yeah so very much like with the green field build I've been working on that for quite a few months yeah, uh, on and off and bits and bobs and all that sort of stuff. And then, I, you know, there was a collection of videos that I did over time as I was doing it. And they all came together and got released. And they were, I had an opportunity to do those videos. If I hadn't done that set, those videos and the things I'd shown you would probably have not been shown to you until further on when I, because of planned videos. Yeah. So you've got planned sort of structured videos. You've got the sort of opportunity videos very much like salute and stuff like that i'm there i'm gonna you know i might as well do a video on it show you know and do that yeah so they're not planned they're opportunity videos and the the last one is sort of a, a realization okay and this was never planned i never thought i'd do videos like these or anything like that yeah and the reason being is that the realization videos this I, i've come up with this little technique yeah and basically, when it comes to videos, or when it comes to like comments and questions and emails, because obviously, you know, I get a lot of comments, I get a lot of emails from terrain builders, from people who are new to terrain building and that sort of stuff. And I'm, I'm always helping people. But when I get a question, yeah, where I know full well, word for word, near enough, the paragraph I'm going to write to reply to that question, then I have answered that question too many times. Yeah, and it deserves a video. Yeah, now a perfect example of this was the beveling bases with a knife and sandpaper. The little controversial video. Yeah, it, you know, I'm not saying anything more on that because it wasn't that controversial, but you know what I mean. But, you know, it seems like such a simple technique, but it was simply like, I got asked that many times, I was like, you know, I need a video. So instead of having to type an entire paragraph explaining how I do it, 
I can point people to the video and show them exactly. Yeah, and so that sort of evolved as time has gone on and more people have contacted me. So when it comes to picking videos, when you're looking at my channel and wondering why has he done this or what's going on with this, it very much is either it's been planned and pretty much all the back to basics videos and the hill videos and that sort of stuff are planned. Yeah, it's been an opportunity video. I've been doing stuff. Uh, some of the Mantic stuff is purely opportunity is opportunity videos because I wouldn't do those videos if you know I hadn't got that kit to be working on same with all different sorts of kits and that sort of stuff and then you've got the sort of realization videos where I realize I really need a video to cover this topic too many people are asking about it so that's where the videos come from okay now continuing our little chat on videos yeah I had a play, you know, where we've talked about video length and, and parts and that sort of stuff in a previous ramble and what you guys thought of it and that sort of stuff. And generally, the vast majority of you are, if I want to split videos down into lots of little bits to make lots of money, go for it. Yeah, uh, but, you know, you really don't mind the long videos. Well, to be perfectly honest, I really can't be backsided, yeah, with splitting videos down and releasing them in five minute clumps just to make money yeah don't like it don't like those sort of trailer videos and that sort of stuff so i won't be doing that i'll be sticking with long videos yeah even if it's not you know advantageous to me commercially to do it i prefer them you prefer them yeah that's what we're doing yeah i did have a play around with doing vlogs yeah with the what you call it with the white house build and they were nice to show you how things were developing and give you little tips. But overall, I felt that I didn't like them. And I think the reason I didn't like them is because as videos, they were very much, the tips were there, but there wasn't enough to make them worthwhile, in my opinion. You know, compared to my other tutorials, which, you know, I cover comprehensively. Yeah. So I, I was thinking about doing vlogs with the art build that I'm working on, and I decided no, watch for it. You know, I didn't like that style. Okay, you know, if, if you want to follow builds, I post pictures up on Facebook or something like that. Yeah, I prefer the idea that my videos are informational, if you know what I mean. And so there's there's a few little tutorials that are coming off that, but you won't see that until the complete board is finished because I won't be able to finish the tutorials until the complete board is finished. Yeah, I, I don't mind that, yeah, but you will have another glut in the videos coming. But basically, vlogs, I'm, I don't like the idea of. Now, the other topic we're going to talk about, yeah, and it sort of ties into this, is the big Burma build. Jindits! 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 <laughs> okay, right, I'm going to have to show you because I'm dead excited with them. They're almost done, my first squad. Right, autofocus. Yeah, let's get out of the seat, folks. Right, let me bring up, we'll do our best to focus so you can have a look. Yeah, there they are, right, where's my Bren guy? I like my Bren guy. Let's see if we can get my Bren guy in focus. Go on, you're probably focusing on the guy behind him. But yeah, these are my chindits, yeah, for my bolt action adventure. Now, as you know, yeah, I am building my own, right, I'm going to switch off the autofocus because it's going to keep focusing in and out on me. As you know, I'm building my own, look at me getting comfortable. I'm building my own, what you call it, jungle board. Yeah, now this is my board, okay? This isn't a, a tutorial piece, this isn't a commission piece, okay? Uh, it's mine. Mine! Yeah, I really am in a giggly mood. I've had too many sugars in my coffee or something. You see, this is what happens, fresh shave on a boat. Ah. Oh. Right, so I'm building my own big Burma board, okay, and obviously I want to show you and I want to also use it as a springboard, yeah, uh, show you tutorials, but, okay, because when I do tutorials, I very typically pick one subject, there's one main learning objective to that, to that tutorial. The rest of the stuff is generally ancillary and I've either already cooked, in fact, if I've shown show anything in you in a tutorial, I always make sure that, you know, there's a, there's a video on every stage up to that point, you know, so I can go in depth on the specific technique, but when it comes to texturing, painting, blocking, all that sort of stuff, I can go, if you don't know how to do it, you know, there's a video off there. Now, when I do my big Burma build, it's going to be slightly different. And the reason for that is that, one, I'm going to be pulling in lots and lots of different techniques, okay, 
to do lots and lots of different things to get the look over all the board which is against what I typically do for my tutorials so I don't want to use the word masterclass yeah because they're not going to be a masterclass because as with all my stuff you know I will explain it in such a way that anyone can follow it yeah I don't like the idea I don't like calling myself my own stuff master classes or anything like that because I don't feel like I'm a master I'm, I, you know I'm always still learning I'm always still cocking up to be perfectly honest uh, so on that basis yeah there's gonna be lots of techniques so I may have to refer you to lots of videos I may you know thing I may do things that you know you look at and think that oh, doesn't seem right or anything like that but it's to a bigger purpose yeah so that's going to be sort of a new style of videos for you okay now they are going to be long videos you know they are, it's, go, it's going to be a long series to be perfectly honest uh, it's going to go on for probably a year or two to be perfectly honest to build the board over time because it's my board now I can't just give up you know months of my time to build my own board yeah we do nothing else yeah <laughs> because you know I've got life and all that sort of stuff, so it's a hobby project for me. But I'm taking you along with it. But you just need to understand that the videos will be a little bit different, but hopefully you'll find them just as informational. You'll, you'll, you'll find them useful, guys. You know, that's that's what I want from this channel. That's what everything I want from this channel. So that's what's going on with the big Burma build and the chin dits, chin dits. Uh, hey, listen, we we need, we need to start a new watch for it, uh, a new drinking game. Because we've already got the one where you know every time you take a drink, every time I say yeah or watch him call it, yeah, every time I say chin dits, you got to take a double chin dits. Don't do that. Seriously, you'll get alcohol poisoning. <laughs> Just seriously, don't do that. Don't, don't. <laughs> but okay, right, guys. I see. I told you to ramble. Yeah. Uh, so we talked about the video topics. You know, you understand how I do my video and how I choose the various topics. You know, you understand what we're doing with the big Burma build. Yeah, and the fact that it's going to, I'm not masterclass, but I'm going to be using lots of different techniques and it'll be a different style of video. It's still going to be tutorials, yeah, because I will be making tutorials out of everything I do, but slightly different style. We're not going to short little clips. You're not going to suddenly find your feed with six five minute clips making up a half hour tutorial so I can claim the clip revenue and all that palaver. No, not into it, not doing it yet. Uh, I'm happy with my patrons guys you know what I mean and all that sort of stuff and you know I don't want to take the pee to be perfectly honest so we're not doing it and I don't like it yeah I like long videos I like something I can sit down with a brew and you know after half an hour I walk away going yeah I've learned something rather than like having every five minutes to click between a video or find the next part or watch the next advert Whew. So anyway, guys, that is how I do my video topics and that sort of stuff. And if you've got any feedback on this and any comments on, you know, what you think about how I do it and that sort of stuff, I know it's very much. I'm not really ask, I'm not really asking for your opinion with this, and I don't want to say don't comment, you know, because you're always welcome to comment. I love comments, yeah. But what I am saying is, you know, this is more explaining why than sort of like what do you think. You know, this is why I do these things, and this is what I'm going to do on the on the watch call it on the big Burma bill. But if you've got any suggestions or anything like that yeah always throw them in the comments guys yeah like it if you like it share it share it if you know and if you really like what i do throw a book throw me a book on patreon because it really really does help yeah and if you don't then don't worry because i'm still going to do it anyway <laughs> that's going to do a bit of a pattern i should record a, a post commercial something like that i don't know that's a massive list of things i've got to do sorry right guys i am rambling and taking up your time listen have a cracking weekend guys yeah right now if you while you're watching this i'm down at uk games expo with john mcleod and little dave fingers crossed i am otherwise something's gone wrong and i hope it hasn't gone wrong because i'm really looking forward to it even though i'm skint i'm going down with me butties and that's about it but i'm going down for a jolly and hopefully yeah corbin's coming with me so I'm, actually i better take some pocket money because corbin will want yeah, don't worry about that, don't worry. But hopefully, yeah, I'll be you'll, you'll be seeing a video on UK Gamer Expo coming up soon, guys. Anyway, I'll see you in the week. All the best, yeah? Ta-da. Bye! Did it! Did it!